Away we go, top tier opponents. A stadium packed to its top tiers. They're playing their tra trade abroad, but the US are away here with Sophia Smith with time and space. And the first effort on goal in the first minute. Mary Earps behind it. Yeah, great indication of what Smith is all about. Direct, straight towards goal. Stanway. Good surge here from Georgia Stanway. Can she pick the right pass? Lays it back. Meet with the effort. Straight. Listen in. Well, the first tester for the American goalkeeper. We know how he would like to get forward quickly. It's a really composed possession. And then that burst forward, USA retreating. They know that the pace that England have got in behind. In the end, it's a sighter, isn't it? Now, England's chance here with Mead. Hemp driving forward, Hemp's in the middle, it's going to break to her! And she puts it away! Lauren Hemp! Strike up, no bother! An England opener against the US! And a smile on the England captain's face and there should be the Americans starting strongly but it's England in front and it's Lauren Hemp their own star and it's all about the run of Beth Mead down that right hand side a little bit more direct with the passage you can see the run she's definitely not offside and then the ball in Hemp she's trying her best to get on the end of it they didn't deal with it well USA and then managed to finish it what a great start it's about being clinical, and that's exactly what England have done in the opening minutes, and USA haven't. Slightly fortunate to get the ball at her feet, but then she still had to finish. Well, for Lauren Hemp, who compared to other players in the front line, didn't score too many at the European Championships, but 10th goal for England, wearing a number nine on the back. Lavelle trying to slide one through, she has that ability, Smith with a shot, Erps is there, England making a mess of it. And the US couldn't force it in. Very close indeed, but the flag is up in any case. Rapino, we know her quality, more craft and guile than the sort of pace that the others have got in that forward line. Oh, trouble here for England! And Sophia Smith! Taking the chance. This young talent, but presented the chance by England. And she wasn't going to miss. Yeah! I've seen already the USA will commit those bodies forward. They've chose to press England at various times when they're playing out from the back, and it has to be perfect. Stanway, who we usually see keeping the ball really well. Obviously wants it, facing her own goal, so difficult. Haran managed to just poke the ball and then we know what Smith's all about. Haran physically very, very strong. Managed to force the ball forward and then Smith, it's wide open and couldn't get enough on it. The press certainly worked there. So Millie Bright for this corner for England. And they apply pressure from the set piece. Break to bronze. Caught in the face there, and England looked towards the referee. Remember, VAR is in operation. Here we go, let's see. Mim Hussain points to the spot. Penalty to England. And she's going to book the substitute. Hayley Mace here, who's trying to run away. Well, Georgia Stanway. From the spot to restore England's advantage. Facing the penalty saving experts. No problem though for Georgia Stanway. England lead again. The doubt it will be the last of the goals though. In quite the first half at Wembley. Oh, that's such an exciting half already and Stanway cool as you like from the spot and she will feel a little bit of responsibility for the USA goal straight ball played to her but all on the spot 
coolest person in the place. The best thing about this England team now, they are not phased about anything, so they're not phased about Wembley, they're not phased about the crowd, they're not phased about the USA. In the past, USA phases everybody, and I think that's ominous for the rest of the world. Rodman, leaving that for Smith. Trouble here for Bright. Smith, clever ball inside, surely Americans are going to score here, and they do, Trinity Rodman. They carved England open there. The longer they take, the more you feel it's offside, and it is indeed offside. So no equaliser for the United States, and disappointment for Trinity Rodman, and a reprieve for England. Walsh, Hemp, dropping off and now can spread the play. Kelly, good position here for Chloe Kelly! Wide. That's where the space is for Kelly if she chooses to cut inside on that right foot. The space is there, not far post, but yeah, it was way out that one. Driving away, England have numbers forward here. Bronze! Side netting. Quite a lot of the time, Lauren Hemp creates something out of nothing. No, absolutely no right to win the ball there, but as soon as she gets it, it's only one thought on her mind. She directs, she runs at the ball with real pace, and I thought the chance was lost at this point, but comes steaming in there. Lucy Bronze hit it with such venom. Just didn't have the accuracy. Into position as Hemp plays inside to Stanway. Here's Georgia Stanway, opened up for her! Couldn't keep it down. Oh, you felt there that the net was going to bulge, but not to be. Uh, a lot of people would have put a lot of money. She did all the hard work, actually, getting the space for herself, and then just didn't take care over that, and that's really unlike Stanway, usually. Absolutely ice cool in front of goal. USA corner. Cued perfectly, but almost worked out for them. Lavelle striking the defender. Penalty. Handball, no doubt. In the referee's mind there. England plead their innocence. Yeah, Lucy Bonds is just telling them to get away because VAR will sort this out. And it just hit her backside, didn't it? So. There's no point at that stage in moaning. So once again, the USA have a decision overturned. Walsh. Kelly couldn't help it on. Here's him. And now Kelly. Stanway. Bronze with the diagonal. Good ball, turn. Loads of time and couldn't. Get over the ball. Haran. Need to get this forward, the US, and that's not the pass of bronze. Gets a head up to clear it. The latest landmark from the Lionesses. They've overcome the number one ranked side in the world. The world champions have been beaten in this prestigious friendly. They continue their unbeaten run under Serena Wiegmann, which stretches to 23 games. What a side this is. What a statement this is. They've beaten the United States of America by two goals to one.